have a question. So, Cherry, are you into topping the guys or you just like a little bit ahead? Um, I'm not going to say I'm into it, but I will. Like, I'm not against it. Now, I'm not going to ask a guy to, but if he gives me signs or asks me to, or he shows me that he's into it, I'm definitely down for it. <laughs> 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 Mom, are you watching House Move again? Uh I'm really surprised that you answered. Cause I'm pretty right. sure you right. just right. started right. your stream. Anybody that line me, um, I, I like to interact with my people or different people just to entertain my people. I just be over here chilling. Any energy is welcome. If it's positive, I'm gonna give back positive. If it's negative, bitches up. So I feel like when you decide to download an app like this on the, on your phone and be active on it, the least you can do is, you know, see what's out there. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Right. Sure. No shade. A lot of the girls call, call me a clout chaser, but no shade. We streamers. We supposed to network. We supposed to connect. No shade. Yeah. So that's how, like that's when, how when you pick up on cloud cloud chasing energy, I know how to handle that. You know what I'm saying? There's a difference between people just vibing and then hoes trying it. Mm-hmm. No shade. The girls have a lot of negative shit to say about you, but no shade. Girl, I think you're a sweetheart. You've been coming into my live stream from since day one. Saying hello, you're beautiful. Like you always show me love. And the girls was like, well, you know, Cherry don't gift. That doesn't matter. We know who Cherry is before she even got one Bigo. Yeah. So, right. I mean, you know I what I'm saying? Like, I was a fan of I, before Bigo, like, a long time ago. I get, ago. Your, I get your energy. No shade. I get your energy for sure. Like, like or you are loved by me, you, many. You, you are loved by many. No shade. Are there any guys on the app that you find attractive that you would date, you know, that you may crush on? No right. shit. If I was to crush on anybody, I would probably crush on a butch queen because I don't know. It's just something like the butch queens give me. They just give what it needs to give. You know. You know what I'm saying? I, I yeah. Agree I, you know they they try to they try to joke on me and clown me because I have and I will entertain a butch queen. I don't look at I look at it as a man as a man. You know there are spags and then there are men. And I like men. And who you slept with before me has nothing to do with me. That's why so many niggas out here who consider themselves straight are lying to people. You know, allow a man to be a man or allow him to lie to you. You know, right. I feel like, especially with us being women of uh, trans experience, bitch, like, I'm so free mm -hmm. with myself. I would never dare tell someone who they can be or how they can or cannot act. Bitch, I want you to be true to you. I want to be able to be attracted to you because there are so many people out here putting on a facade and pretending to be this man that they're really not. And people are falling in love with strangers. Right. And then years later, yeah. when they find out who the fuck they're really dealing with, bitch, you do not like this person you've had kids with and you've married and you spent so much of your life with because they never had the true space to be themselves. Right. Because, bitch, I'm going to be me in every room. And honestly, I think that's what I find attractive about a lot of butch queens because I think it is so masculine for a man to say, this is who I am, and a bitch ain't going to check me about it. That part. That part. Yeah. yeah. So, Cherry, what's your zodiac sign? Cancers. <laughs> oh, yes. Okay, okay. I love me a cancer. I'm a Capricorn. No shade. no shade. No shade. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I feel like we should bring up like a topic and have, have a discussion. We do that, but have a little topic. I think you're, you're, that you're good at that, uh, Royal. Well, yeah, you're good about bringing up topics and then, you know, be our narrator. Okay. Well, the first question is Go ahead, Royale. Uh uh. Go ahead, Cherry. <laughs> you're trying to. You, you trying to... Girl, you trying to... That Paul scared me. That Paul scared me. That Paul scared me. I'm going to let the beautiful Ray out. So, okay, so, okay, the first question is, Trey, have you ever dealt with a trans girl? Uh, I've gotten hit from a trans girl several times. 
So I think we're getting our question. I think we're getting our answer already. But if you was to deal with a, a trans girl, right? And she she your girl for real, but you know, she like you to go down on her sometimes, would you? You talking about sucking dick? A pussy huh? pole. We're talking about sucking pussy pole. I ain't sucking nothing. Never have. Okay, so what never I have guess that's Never have, never, never set the pole, never been fucked, never. But it's not, I ain't, I haven't. I would never. Oh, you would never, okay. No, nah. I'm 40 years old, I know what I like and don't like, so. Okay, absolutely, As you're entitled to that, go ahead, I'm with you. I know exactly mm -hmm. what I like and what I don't like. Royale, with you um, being a one of the beautiful girls, um, how do you feel about dealing with a guy who does not give you head? Um. Oh my God, I'm in a spotlight. <laughs> Fuck. Some okay, so, that don't, I know some some, some so I really don't, friends don't like. I that. really don't like to be toyed with, but if I if I'm like if I love you, if I'm like in like. I don't know. I do, but you have to be attractive. No shade. You have to be somebody that I really want, like to touch everything, all of me. Like you have to be that. You have to be that guy. Um. You just. You Girl, just wait! I am lost. I am lost. I am so lost right now. Girl, what? Because I was lost that you don't like to be toyed with. So, um, you're saying I, if you I really mean, like him, if you really like him, you don't want head or you do? I do. But if I'm not attracted to you like that, I don't want you like, you know, I want you to You're not comfortable. Meaning you're not comfortable. <laughs> so, girl, why are we even with anybody we don't like? Well, I mean, no, but, but, no, I, I, oh, no, I get it. I get it. Um, I don't have a lot of sex partners anyway. So when, like, most of the time when I'm dealing with a guy, nine times out of ten, he's like, he he's what? my type, you know. Um, a lot of them are not really into that. Mm. So, um... Okay, let me stop being a fake ass bitch. No shade. I'm being a fake ass bitch right now. Listen, I like a little whoop de whoop de whoop de whoop de whoop. You know what I'm saying? But I'm the type of girl like I could also pay it. You feel what I'm saying? Okay. Well, shout out to those girls because I'm the type of girl we're not paying it. And the only way we're going to have a good time is if we do everything and we please everybody. Um, and that's just how it goes. Now, I don't have to penetrate a guy that I like, but I'm going to get some head. And the reason why I am so stern on that now is because I was in a relationship with a guy and because he did live more of a heterosexual lifestyle. I tried to um, please him in those ways where he only, you know, fucked and received head. And bitch, I was not sexually. Um, I was not sexually pleased. And it became so a problem. I have a question. So, Cherry, are you into topping the guys, or you just like a little bit ahead? Um, I'm not gonna say I'm into it, but I will. Like, I'm not against it. Now, I'm not gonna ask a guy to, but if he gives me signs or asks me to, or he shows me that he's into it, I'm definitely down for it. <laughs> 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 yeah, you not girl. Baby, no Shay, <laughs> honestly, I think honestly, I think I'm very picky though. Like you have to have a really nice frame like down there. Like you have to it has to be almost feminine in a sense. Like it's it's weird for me. I don't really like 
I really don't like muscle bound man. I don't like oh girl, you but is kid. But no, I'm this. serious. Like you have to have like you have to have a balance of masculinity and femininity when it comes to your body in order for me to go there. Oh God, I say that all the time. You get it. I say that all the time. Like, girl, like when it comes to my, my blue tweens, I love like, a, I kind of, I think I kind of like a feminine top. And then I like, um, like the guys that be painting their nails and like, coloring their hair like i feel like you have to have like i like well-groomed men fingernails manicures like i like that i like that feminine side but not a bitch like you can still knock a nigga out they do it for me yeah 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 because i think me and say me and me and men who live a heterosexual lifestyle we don't really click because i feel like a lot of their masculinity masculinity is fake so they do the most trying to aggravating too. Like, bitch, I'm not about yeah, to give you head and you just stick your dick in me. That's not happening. It blows me. Like, girl, stop fighting yourself. Like, bitch, relax. It's okay. Fire, 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 fire.